What the hell are you? No! 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 Scanning. Control. Manipulate scientific data. Take over. Blast. Control. World government. Gives me a boner. I like it. She's fit. Yeah, I'd fuck her. It's astonishing. It's absolutely world class. How is this real life? How how is this a real thing? Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. How good is he? I'm looking at him. I'm like, oh. Here's my money. Take it. Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? Shocking. Dreadful. No quality. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need. You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. And if you use code McShell, you'll get a 5% discount. Alright boys and girls, today is going to be a very cheeky day, okay? Today boys, we're going to be looking at one of the best center mids that is in the game right now, okay? And he's not even that expensive. When I saw the League and Tots leaks the other day, lads, I was going through the cards and I was thinking, Jesus Christ, I'm not going to be able to afford any of these guys. I'm, I was worrying a little bit. Like, obviously there are a couple of cheap ones, but most of these League and Team of Seasons, I, I just, I'm well aware that, that I'm not going to be able to afford them, okay? Neymar, Messi, Mbappe, like these guys are just well off the cards. One of the cards that I thought there was no way I was going to be able to afford was for Fana because I remember his headliner price being ridiculously expensive. Like that card cost a lot of money and I just kind of assumed that this one would be the same because you know he has a he has a ridiculous card again. But to my surprise as I picked this card up for about 400k and I imagine he actually comes down in price by the time this video comes out he's probably only going to be about 300k which is absolutely mind blowing to me lads because I mean it's, it's a perfect centre mid but like it's literally like he is, he is nearly 90 in every like base card stat. It's insane to me. The only thing that I can really think of is the reason he's not as expensive as the others is because of, of the lack of skill moves but is there really a need for, for skill moves on center mids so yeah i just don't understand this price tag lads i think it's a ridiculously good card for the price so yeah guys we've thrown him into a very cheeky team okay and when i say cheeky i do mean cheeky defensively i've just gone with a complete sweatiness like i, I just give up with defenders at this point it doesn't really matter who i use in defense i'm usually shit anyway yes that is true midfield of course you've got to have the bald head in there we've got defoe who i'm not going to be playing as a center mid obviously but i'll change that in game kimmich over here lads is of course a ridiculous card and then at the top of the team lads we've got our ivorian beasts okay we got the we got the triple ivory coast here my boy Haller, who i absolutely loved when i did the Serie A team in the season team he was a, he was an absolute demon Drogba, who i don't think i've used this year i might have used him early on but i honestly can't remember and then of course that's we got our boy for fun so let's dive into these in games so starting off lads you got high high work rate six at one three star skills and four star weak foot so in my opinion that's a pretty good start for a center mid 90 pace lads obviously that goes out saying for for a center mid that's really good 87 shooting here lads obviously that's really good okay you got really good positioning maybe not the best finishing but that's more than made up for with ridiculous shot power and long shots passing is super good there lads 90 passing is is obviously amazing 92 dribbling is insanely good maybe not the best balance but that is made up for with really good composure in-game dribbling and ball control defensively lads honestly like th that's just grim okay 98 interceptions and 98 standing tackle like what the hell he's the greatest defensive player i've ever seen and then finally physically lads you got ridiculously good stamina insanely good strength and super good aggression so overall, I mean, look at this card, boys. Like, how is this card, like, illegal? The only stat that's not 90 or above is shooting, and it's not exactly bad, is it? I mean, this card is insanely good, and I just, again, I assume this card would be, like, well over a million coins, so for him to be this cheap is super surprising to me. But yeah, we'll jump into a bit of gameplay with this team, lads, hoping to get some wins, some goals, all that good stuff. So yeah, we'll jump into game number one. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep running for Fana. Nice. And for Fana with the early goal. Oh, he's hit the ball. That's unlucky. Okay, lovely. And then for Fana, long shot. Oh, <laughs> for Fana. You cheeky little fucker. That was a filthy long shot, lads. That was absolute pure filth. What the f- who hit that? I think that's Drogba for him. It is Drogba. That was hit with- I mean, it's not surprising because it is Drogba. But that was a really powerful shot. It's going away. Oh, look at that space! Come on, Hella. Come on, Hella, on the volley. That is a terrible volley, Hella. Come on, lad. Play now. Oh, that could be a beaut. It is a beaut. Hella! Oh, Hella! What an interception that is from Kimmich. Oh, he didn't play it! Come on. Come on, Hella. Brilliant! One more to Seco! Oh, Seko's got another, lads. I am loving his positioning so far, lads. He is getting in all the right spots. 
Yeah, yeah. Can you run? Keep running to foe. Play him now. The drop bird. Why are you running into the foe like that? Oh, he's giving away though. Come on. Yep. And then. Oh, dropper. Oh, dropper. Oh, please. He's offside. I thought he was, and then a fucking lineman took an eternity to put his flag up, so I thought it was on, and then I. Oh. Shit, please. What a set do deck. You might be in the Hall of Famer goalkeepers for me. Like, one of the rare goalkeepers that I like. Nice. Back to beautiful football between the baldies. Oh, lads, I'm not being funny, but this Fafana shooting is absolutely cracked. You're broken. Yeah, for it through. Oh, Fafana's getting in on the assisting. Come on, Drogba. Oh, lad. No, no, why did I not go in? Oh, God, please, no. Please don't get back in it. Uh, right, do deck. I, I actually might have to suck your penis. And thread it through. Look at that run, though. Can we just talk about the run from Fafana? And fuck it, I'm cracking it. I shouldn't have done that. But the run was cheeky. Nice. That's beautiful for Fafana. It's falling to Drogba. And then Drog right, Drogba. I'm actually going to have to fucking punch you in the nose if you miss again. Oh, shit. That's a good ball. That is not cool. That's a good finish. Oh, god damn. Right, we better not bottle this, boys. Right, we've only got three minutes left, and we, we already know that I'm capable of bottling this, but can we not do that? Please blow the whistle. Thank you, boys. Free to win the rare Michelle dub at the start of an episode. You don't see that often. For Farn Hat Trick as well, that is a great start to the episode, lads. Absolutely love that. Nice, Chalibur. He's been rock solid at the back so far, for the most part. Yes, through! Come on, come on, Hella. Get me off to a cheeky start! Oh, lads, I am actually balling out with this team. I'm really enjoying it so far. It's an unlikely bunch of heroes, because it's not maybe the most, like, ridiculous team you've ever seen, but I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, shit. Oh, not good. That's one up. That's one oh god damn it. I had to open my mouth and, and big up my team, didn't I? If I kept my mouth closed, it's still 1-0 right now. No, not there! Through the middle! Oh, but Fafana wins it back. What a baller. What an absolute monster. Oh, I see that back post cross. I see it. Look at that for a ball. What a finish again for Fafana. I am loving this card so far, lads. Some of the best positioning I've ever seen. Is he wrong, though? Okay, what a pass from Fafana. Little overlap run from Drogba. Cross it over. Lads. No. Oh, I thought a guaranteed goal. But you never know. You never know. Oh, no. No. Why is it not going in then? Oh, shit. Oh, no, no, no. Dude, eh? God, I've, been, I've been saying such good things about you today. What, what, what do you do? Why'd you do that? Oh, I see that run for far. No, I, honestly, lads, it's like playing with another striker. It re- No, he's missed it. Alright, so it's not like playing with another striker, because- uh, Well, actually, then again, Michelle strikers do like to miss, but seriously, why has why he missed that? Like, that's actually upset me to my core. That is an insane pass. Like, where does that even go? A dude that saved me again, because he's a lad. Oh, come on. Drop it, drop it back. Yes! One more to Bold! Bold gotta be! Oh, lad, I'm loving it. The midfield at the mid- It's all- I'm trying to think now. I've scored literally every goal with my midfield, I swear. Feel pain. Oh, god damn it, lads, come on! Can we just stay in the lead for more than a minute? That's nice, let off, beautiful. Yeah, play through. Bold! Bold! Don't miss it! Yeah, oh, that's a just... No, do that, I'm sorry. He's not, no, I was oh, literally, as soon as I'm about to say such good things, I was literally about to praise do that beyond belief. I mean, it's not his fault, but EA just wanted it in the net for some reason there. And play now. Come on, Fafana. Beautiful. Oh, please. All right, we got it back, lads. This is a this is a big game. The four all. Sixty fourth minute. Like this is an epic game. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake! So some of this guy's passing is really good. There's nothing I can do about that. There's nothing I can do about that. Okay. Play now. 
What a pass for Fauna! No, no, he saved it, right? No, he didn't save it for Fauna. My disappointment is immeasurable, and my day is ruined. Ah, that's all she wrote, lads. That is annoying. That was a really good game, though, I won't lie. Like, it wasn't like an enraging game. It was just a good back-and-forth game, and it was it was fun. Of course, there's going to be some aids, but as far as FIFA goes, that wasn't that aids, and oh, that was all right. I can take that. But we still got to do the press for or dance, so it is what it is. Shit. No, lads, come on. We started this episode so good. Let's not end it badly. Oh my god, what a cross. Control. Oh no, no, Drogba. That was bullying. The way he towered over that defender was absolutely unreal. Beautiful. Nice. Look at him, boy. He's just a tank. He's an absolute tank. You cannot stop him. He, he's like... I know this is going to be a weird analogy. He's like... You know, like the old GTA games? You know, you put the cheat code in and you'd unlock the tank and you'd just, like, just bulldoze your way and blow up a load of cars and shit. That's what he's like. He just runs through people and they blow up. Oh, shit. For God's sakes. I just... I don't know what it is, boys. I just can't seem to play well consistently. I started this episode off, like, incredibly. I couldn't be stopped. And now we're kind of becoming old, Miguel. Oh, for goodness sake. Please don't score. Ah! Come on. Brilliant. And it's Seco. Seco, lads, I love him. I don't know what to say anymore. I just truly love him. He's a beautiful human being. Oh yeah, look at Drogba. Come on, Drogba. Oh, Drogba, you monster, please. Finesse. Oh, come on, lads. Right back in it. What a comeback. Okay. Right. Fafana makes the run. He loves making cheeky runs, lads. Come on. Come on, Fafana. Oh, that's a ridiculous save. No. Oh, did he save it? He actually did. Dude, you are a god. You're the GOAT. Wanted that. What the hell? What the fuck, lads? How are we gonna concede a goal that easy? Get your head on it and get it out. That's what we gotta do there to avoid that. What the hell is this guy doing? Just gotta get rid of that. Come on. Drop it back. No! That's it, isn't it? Because he's just gonna pass around the back for the last minute. For fuck's sake. I've actually lost another game by a goal. And he's not even. These aren't like games I've been dicked on. And that is annoying. That is just annoying. Because I, whether or not I get dicked or not, it's kind of irrelevant. Because if I don't win, I don't win. And the fact that Fafana was goated in this episode and has still only won one game is, is just depressing. But yeah, guys, let's talk about this Fafana card. Because honestly, I've got nothing but good things to say about him. First of all, we'll talk about his goals, okay? I believe he scored four goals in three games from centre mid, which is amazingly good. To put that into perspective, Perspective, lads. In the last episode, we tried out three team of seasons, all three of them being attackers, and none of them got more goals than that. I think the most score, like goals I scored was three. So the fact that Fafana is outscoring strikers for me is is pretty fucking nuts. Let's also talk about this card's work rate. Okay, look at that heat map. This guy is everywhere. He's defending. He's attacking. He's getting in the right areas. He's in there for crawl. Like he's literally got it all. This card's positioning, lads, is out of this world. Okay, some of the best that I've ever seen. He was just always in the right spot, popping up when I needed him for an easy pass and an easy goal, or if I was looking for a long shot he would just lurk on the edge of the box and he'd be there to bang those like i said lads there's, there's honestly nothing bad to say about him he's an absolute monster so yeah boys let's run him through the cheeky meter lads i'm gonna give him a 10 out of 10 because i honestly can't think of anything more that he could have done he was great defensively his passing was superb the dribbling was insane shooting was goaded he was fast as fuck like literally everything you could possibly want in a midfielder he had it but yeah i'm gonna call it there boys i hope you did enjoy if you did smash that subscribe and i'll see you guys next one all right peace